Meet Spot. Spot is a robot that was designed to work in the oil industry, gas industry, basically to send to places where you wouldn't want to send a human. Now that technology is headed in a new direction with students modifying it to become a robo guide dog. They've got some work ahead of them though. So far, controlling Spot has been... Pretty bad. A guide dog user himself, Santiago Belasquez, is drawing on his lived experience to fine tune its performance. He's very good in terms of walking straight, but when he turns, uh, because he's rigid, he is very jerky. This is only the first step in providing choice and accessibility for people with vision impairment. There are people that want the benefits of a guide dog, but don't want to look after an animal. It's going to take probably 15 to 20 years before a, a robot like Spot here could be used as a guide dog. Perfecting the capabilities of robots only needs to be done once, avoiding two years of training every dog. But Guide Dogs Queensland says the technology will always have limitations. Nothing will be the companionship and the intuition of the dog. For them to be able to afford to think, see ahead, make the early movements to um, guide someone safely. More than 60 puppies are bred here every year and about 40% have the right qualities to become guide dogs. Training them costs more than $50,000 per dog. The QUT team will keep working on Spot, including giving it a head. But useful as the technology may become, it will never love you back. Hey buddy. Meg Bolton, ABC News.